Hi, I'm Jack Bertuzzi with EcoG Solar. Uh, EcoG is a developer, financier, and owner operator of distributed solar and storage assets. We've been around for about six years now and we're really focused on uh, financing smaller distributed assets with uh, traditionally more difficult credits to finance uh, such as affordable housing and nonprofit entities. Uh, today we've done about 30 systems and close to five megawatts worth of, of solar. We're, we're really interested in trying to come up with strategies that help us to save money. And why do we need to do that? Because we need to stretch every dollar that we get so we can provide the maximum level of services that we can to our residents. And through this arrangement, that they have created, the housing authority will be able to purchase electric power for its mid-rise buildings and some of its high-rise buildings uh, at a reduced rate. And this 1.1 uh, megawatt uh, solar park is, is going to be an outstanding uh, project for the city, for the community, and for WHA. There are approximately 3,500 housing authorities across the United States, and if there's a common denominator for all of us, it's that we want our residents to become productive citizens in the community, and that means that they need job training and, and, and uh, job placement. So uh, one, of the, one of the benefits of this project will be that it will provide some employment for some of the citizens that will live in the community that will benefit from, from the uh, solar energy. EcoG Solar, in direct partnership with the Wilmington Housing Authority, plans to redevelop a brownfield to construct a 1.15 megawatt ground mount solar garden at no upfront and ongoing cost to WHA. Financed by a power purchase agreement and administered through virtual net metering, this project will offset electrical consumption of several WHA buildings, including high rises and mid rises, which couldn't access solar. Our experienced and dedicated team believes this is an innovative project that can unlock solar access in the urban environment. We can scale this model to all the housing authorities in the U.S. to be more inclusive of those who do not have access to solar. Over the next three years, our goal is to develop 10 to 15 megawatts a year of similar projects with 10 to 20 housing authorities. With this project, EcoG and WHA hope to prove that by focusing on underserved communities, our renewable energy transition will be transformative for both our planet and our community.